Hi, I'm Tim Hungerford. Welcome to part four of our inventory costing series. Today we're going to focus on average costing. 101 for the beginner accountant. So average costing is also called weighted average costing. Weighted average means it takes into account the quantities. Today we're going to do a very simple method of that. So first we're going to start out with our store. We're going to open an adult beverage store. So we've got to go buy some inventory. So there's our first six pack of inventory. That cost six dollars or one dollar per can. But that's not enough. We need to go buy more inventory. So we've got another six pack that cost us seven dollars and fifty cents or a dollar twenty five per can. But I guess social media has gone crazy about us opening up our adult beverage store so we want to get a little more inventory. So let's go get some. Wow, did the price increase. We actually had to spend $13.50 for this six pack or $2.25 a can. Okay, so now we've got all our inventory and we're ready to go. Let's add up our inventory. It's $27. Now we have to divide that by the number of cans we have to come up with an average cost or a weighted average cost. There are 18 cans. We divide that by 18 and our average cost is $1.50 per can. So now we can start our operations. In fact, we sell six of these. They can come from anywhere. We're just selling six of these. We don't care whether they were the new stuff or the old stuff. Selling six of them. So now it comes time for our costing. Our cost of goods sold, or our cost of goods sold, will be $1.50 times the six cans that we sold. And that winds up being $9. So we have $9 in cost of goods sold. As for our inventory, we have 12 cans left. That means we have $18 of inventory remaining on our balance sheet and nine dollars has gone to cost of goods sold. So if you'll notice, it still equals when we add our cost of goods sold plus our inventory, the twenty-seven dollars of costs available for sale or our total purchases. If you need to understand some of the other inventory methods, please check out some of the other videos and remember to comment below on any videos you'd like to see about accounting and remember to subscribe. Thanks and have a great day.